no heavens on the go. Friday, August 5th, 2022. Topic, study. Memory verse, 2 Timothy 2.15. Study to show thyself approved unto God, a workman that needed not to be ashamed, rightly dividing the word of truth. Bible reading, Daniel 9, 1-7. In the first year of Darius, the son of Ahasuerus, of the seed of the Medes, which was made king over the realm of the Chaldeans. In the first year of his reign, I, Daniel, understood by books the number of the years, whereof the word of the Lord came to Jeremiah the prophet, that he would accomplish seventy years in the desolations of Jerusalem. And I set my face unto the Lord God to seek my prayer and supplications, with fasting and sackcloth and ashes. And I prayed unto the Lord my God and made my confession and said, O Lord, the great and dreadful God, keeping the covenant and mercy to them that love him and to them that keep his commandments. We have sinned and have committed iniquity and have done wickedly and have rebelled even by departing from thy precepts and from thy judgments. Neither have we hearkened unto thy servants, the prophets, which spake in thy name to our kings, our princes, and our fathers, and to all the people of the land. O Lord, righteousness belongeth unto thee, but unto us confusion of faces, as at this day to the men of Judah, and to the inhabitants of Jerusalem, and unto all Israel that are near and that are far off through all the countries whither thou hast driven them because of their trespass that they have trespassed against thee. The message. Many people these days hardly study. Most youths, would rather spend their time on social media than read books or conduct meaningful research. Every great person became so because they studied and learned the right things to get to where they are today. So, if you want to be great, learn to study. Some years back, you would have to visit a library in person to get the materials that you want to study. But now, you can find most of what you need on the internet. I wonder then why many people still don't study. There are certain circles of influence that you cannot reach if you don't study. The Bible says you need to study to show yourself approved. 2 Timothy 2.15 there are certain heights you cannot reach for God if you are not studious. Peter was a great man of God whose shadow was healing the sick, Acts 5.15. In fact, Peter became the leader of the apostles, but Paul was the one who did a whole lot more amongst the apostles, and that is because he was an educated man. Most of the New Testament was written by Paul because he was educated and wrote many letters. We have many anointed Christians, but not many influential ones because not many are willing to study. In the first year of his reign, I, Daniel, understood by books the number of the years whereof the word of the Lord came to Jeremiah the prophet that he will accomplish 70 years in the desolations of Jerusalem. And I set my face unto the Lord God to seek by prayer and supplications with fasting and sackcloth and ashes. Daniel 9, 2-3 Daniel knew there was a need to pray. 
He knew the correct prayers to offer because he studied the right books. Such people, some people keep suffering in certain situations because they don't know the truth about what they are facing. Some don't even study the Bible to see what the Word of God says about their problems. Daniel 12.4 says that in the last days, knowledge will increase. This is coming to pass. The world is increasing in knowledge. Don't leave the knowledge that will influence this world to the devil. Go and get that knowledge too and use it for the kingdom of God. Key point, make studying your lifestyle. Bible reading in one year, Ecclesiastes 4 to 8. Him for today, deeper, deeper in the love of Jesus. The Open Heavens is written by Pastor E. A. Adeboye, the General Overseer of the Redeemed Christian Church of God. God bless you.